course, put on safety goggles. Take your bamboo and your saw. So now that you have your piece of bamboo, take your measuring tape and you want to measure three centimeters from the top. And make a mark with your Sharpie. Next, you want to take your measuring tape and go from that point and measure eight centimeters and make a point. After that, you want to make two marks that are two centimeters from each. So there would be eight, ten, and twelve. And for your last mark, you want to go down three centimeters, so you would make, mark it at fifteen. First mark, you want to go. To, you want to go to the middle, not all the way through the bamboo, cutting the bamboo off. You want to go to the middle. So start sawing at the at your mark that you made. Once you've made your hole, take your knife and angle it so that you're making a hole where your reed, where your reed's going to catch the air. Now that you have made something that looks something like this, you're going to want to take your drill with a 1 4th inch bit and you're going to want to drill where you marked your um, where your holes were going to be. Now take a stick, and this stick is, is you're going to want to make sure that it fits in perfectly so that it goes, It's this is going to be your reed, so that it goes, the, you see it through the hole, and maybe cut it another inch out. So I'm going to mark it right now, and I'm going to take this stick out. You're going to want to make sure that it fits in there pretty well. And now you want to take your um, saw and saw it. Now that you have your stick, you're going to want to put it in to check it and you want to shave it down so when you blow in it, the air will the air will make the reed vibrate creating a sanding wave and that will allow your sound to work. So shave it down. So make sure when you shave it that you're making this side bigger and shaving it down to get smaller at the end. Once you get your reed to look like this, you're going to want to sand it down. Once you have your reed, once you have your reed and your the basis of put the reed in, find which position works best works best for the air, um, which gives you the best sound. Once you find that position, you're gonna want to glue it into that spot, and there you go.